Good afternoon, I'm David Navarro. And I'm Shade Bedrinwa. Liz is off. We begin this afternoon with that football tragedy in New Jersey. A beloved sophomore high school player died after an apparent head injury on the field. His friends and teammates remember him as a fun-loving teen and dedicated to the sport he loved. Now, for the first time, we're hearing from his heartbroken parents. Eyewitness News reporter Anthony Johnson is live in Linden with more. Anthony. Yeah, the Linden Tigers football team, they're back on the field this afternoon, but you can certainly imagine that all of the players, coaches, and staff, they're out there with very heavy hearts. And yes, this morning we had an opportunity to talk to the parents of Xavier McLean. We met with them just moments after they were making the final funeral arrangements for their son. You know, I'm just going to try to put my wife back together and... I just hope this don't happen to no other kids playing ball. This is unimaginable for anyone, especially parents. I'm hurting. I lost, I lost my boy. I lost He's my only son. 16. Yeah, this whole life ahead. 16. Norm and Lisa McLean must cope with unthinkable pain. He's so loved. He's got a lot of family. And it's not fair that I'm burying my son. Their 16-year-old son, Xavier, called X, died this week from an injury he suffered on the football field back on September 9th in a game against Woodbridge. He was on the kickoff team for the Linden Tigers when he was hit on a play and suffered a traumatic injury. His parents regret the fact that it was the one game they missed. We never missed a game. And this one we missed. And, we missed And it. I got to live with that. I wasn't at that game. We've never I, missed this game. Norm McLean had coached his son since the age of five and watched him grow as a football player. That yeah, boy was loved. He was in every sport, social, bright, gifted, and talented. <laughs> and I'm never going to see him graduate from high school. As the Linden community tries to come to grips with this football tragedy, Lisa and Norm McLean struggle to stay strong, but realize it's going to take time. One thing at a time. That's all I'm asking. One thing. Just, just let us bury our son. son. That's Please, all we he, needs, do right he needs to do it the right way. Xavier has, we have to give him the right burial the way he would want it. The McLeans are certainly devastated. Now, the team was supposed to play a game against Perth and Boy this evening. That game has now been postponed until tomorrow. But before the game starts, there will be a short memorial service to remember Xavier McLean.